JJ, disappointing results. What do you make of that game? Yeah, I think it's very disappointing. After last week especially, we wanted to put things right today. I think the worst part probably, we probably didn't perform as we should, but I think it's another game we probably handed them the three points. I don't think they done nothing special to beat us. I think we played all right stuff. We created some chances, but in the end, as I said, we, we kind of handled them the game. We didn't really create many clear-cut chances. No. Is that maybe a concern for the group now? I wouldn't say it's a concern. You go through these spells, strikers go through spells when they're not scoring, and obviously it's not just up to the strikers, it's up to the midfielders and um, us building to try to get them the service and create chances for them, and obviously hopefully they can take them. But it happens during the season, and we just have to look at Monday and, and kick on. God, we did it tonight, he closed it last week. Team seemed to start to drop off now. Is that maybe a consequence of we're not the chasers anymore, we're the team being chased and teams are quite happy now to drop off and see what we're made of. Yeah, yeah, I think obviously after the start we had, people were looking at us and thinking we're the team to stop and that results in teams obviously sitting in and, and trying to dig in against us and it's up to us to be patient and not lose head. I think too often we just result in end going long, I think we have to force things, I think we need to score as quick as we can but I think it's down to us to be patient and and control the build-up and chances will come, so that's just something as us we need to get better at because obviously we haven't been used to it and teams are, are wanting to beat us now as we are on top, but it means nothing if we keep dropping silly points. Is it difficult in your position particularly to stay patient like that in games where maybe a tendency could be to try and bob a few balls in? Is it a difficult thing to do to stay disciplined and just keep trying to play our way in? Yeah, I think that's more just down to myself and whoever's playing in the middle. I think you just have to tell yourself there's no rush. And whatever minute it is, doesn't matter if there's a couple minutes to go, half an hour. It's down to us to be patient and keep side to side, moving it, waiting on gaps. But as I said, yeah, it's just you need to stay in control and, and don't get flustered in the game. It's four games without a win. As one of the more experienced players in the group now, do you feel a little bit more pressure, a little bit more burden on the shoulders maybe? I wouldn't say pressure. Obviously, there's a few young boys, but us people have been here the longest. Obviously, I'm here this is my fourth season, so you know I want to do well and I should be looked upon to, to dig us out sometimes along with a few other players. But yeah, it is down to us. Obviously, I'm probably one of the senior players now, so we do have to take more responsibility on our shoulders. Yeah. With the short turnaround before the Rovers game on Monday, is there much the group can do between now and then as a group to maybe reset and get going or is it just an individual mindset thing now between now and Yeah, now? it's more individual obviously as a group, you know, we can just dust ourselves down and we can't dwell on it too long, but I think individually you have to get your head around it. With the, we're back in tomorrow and Sunday, so I think as you said, dust yourself down, we don't have a week to get over things and a week of preparation and training and stuff, so we just gotta go again Monday. When you strip it all back, we are still top of the league, haven't played, I think it's 11 games. Yeah. It's important people maybe don't panic now, there's always going to yeah. come a difficult stage in the season. Is it important that people maybe just yeah. keep a level head now and kind of take it for what it is? Yeah, definitely, obviously, the start. If, if you had said to us at the start of the season, we'd be top with, as you said, 11 games to go. I think everyone would have bit their hand off for it. So there's going to be difficult spells in the season, and I think you learn more about yourself from the losses than you do the wins, and it's about um, coming back from that and getting over it as quick as you can. Are you looking forward to Monday now? Getting back to Tolkien, it'll be packed out, it'll be a big yeah. atmosphere. Obviously, we're missing support tonight. Do you think maybe it could have helped push the group a little bit? Yeah, obviously, it's, it's a blow not having the fans here. You know, at times when you need them to give you a bit of a boost, they're there and they always do. So that was tough today, obviously, but we were hoping to get a win for them, not being here. But Monday, definitely, if it's a sellout, we, we need them there behind us and, and driving us. Thanks, JJ. Not a bother, let's